just goes to show your ignorance, you damn devils. And it says, in the voice of harpers and musicians and of pipers and trumpeters shall be heard no more at all in thee, and no craftsman or whatsoever crafty be shall be found any more in thee. So, hey man, all, all this shit is done with. Alright, and the sound of a millstone shall be heard no more at all in thee. And the light of a candle shall shine no more at all in thee. This place is done. It's through. Right, and the voice of the bridegroom, uh, and that's the spirit, because you have um, candles, right? You have uh, you have candles that are used uh, um, with uh, uh, with witches, right? People that uh, um, use dark magic. Those that's, that, those candles are a representation of your wicked ass. Just like you have the you know you have righteous candles, right? You got you got wicked ass lights too, man. And it says, the voice of the bridegroom and of the bride shall be heard no more at all in thee, for thy merchants were the great men of the earth, for by thy sorceries were all nations deceived. So through your witchcraft, you damn devils, even your establishment of this place, man. Right? Yeah, and they knew that. They knew that back then, that this was going to be the number one place for commerce. Right, for quote unquote fashion, for decadence, for shops. They imagine these things, man. The Lord put the spirit on these different quote unquote founding fathers and the people that funded them to imagine these things. Imagine, imagine a, 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 a country where you can do whatever you want, be whatever you want to be. All right, because all, all, all of those founding fathers were flamers, man. Including those guys on the Declaration of uh, Independence when they wrote down all their signatures, all of them were flamers, man. A lot of them, okay, through the spirit, were dealing with each other, man. That's why you got these different um, uh, events like uh, uh, Bohemian Grove and these other uh, these other events. They well, they're, they're dealing with each other, okay. They're gonna have a, a, a meeting on foreign affairs. Then they're gonna have some 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 freak ass party after that all right okay we've 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 done it we've, we've you know created legislation for this and that now it's time to party and you already know what they're sipping on man this hey they're sipping on that they're sipping on that egg juice all right they're sipping on that fear factor juice if you can catch my drift okay that uh um that a chrome laptop juice all right. If I if I say the word, they're gonna definitely uh you know take uh, you know uh, take take the trans take the transmission and dump it in the trash, man. And these are and these are uh, um video epistles that are transmitted throughout the world with the with uh, uh, the internet, man. This is how we came into the truth. This word was spread all across the four corners of the earth. All right, and what does it say in the book of Matthew that that this word shall reach the, the ends of the earth and then the end shall come roughly paraphrasing so we in them times we in the times where this is being spread all across the four corners of the earth this ain't this ain't our doctrine this is the doctrine of Yahweh by Hashem Yahweh Shai okay and so it says verse 24 and in her was found the blood of prophets and of saints and of all that were slain upon the earth Hey man, so it's gonna be all, all kinds of dead, man. Hey, we might have to we might have to die for you. How about Shimei Shai's sake, man? Being up in here, we might get tortured to death. You know, they, man, E, e is gonna have some shit for us. Guillotines, man. Might might have us getting trampled to death, torn apart by dogs, torn apart by people. You no, know, they may they may they may starve a group of people and then just throw you in there, man. All right, lock you up till you die. No food, no water. This is the damn devil we're talking about, man. All right, and it says, Revelation chapter nineteen and verse one. 
And after these things, I heard a great voice of much people in heaven saying, Halal Aloy Yahweh, salvation and glory and honor and power unto the Lord our power, Yahweh Bahashem Yahweh Shai. For true and righteous are his judgments. For he hath judged the great whore, America, which did corrupt the earth with her fornication, and hath avenged the blood of his servants at her hand. And again, they said, Halal Aloy Yahweh. And her smoke rose up forever and ever. And the four and twenty elders and the four beasts fell down and worshipped Yahweh that sat on the throne, saying, Amen, Halal Aloy Yahweh. And a voice came out of the throne, saying, Praise our power. All right? Call Halal Yahweh by Shimei Hashai. All ye his servants, and ye that fear him, both small and great. So you see how the servants of Yahweh by Shimei Hashai, you know, are seen as uh, uh, the, the, the top representation. Now the Lord, now the Lord loves Israel, right? Especially the elect of Israel, and amongst the elect of Israel, the top men are these men that you read about. You know, uh, all these, all these men that that wrote down. I mean, let's 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 go through it. Let me just let me just uh, scan. Isaiah, okay, Jeremiah, all right, Paul, Ezekiel, you know, Habakkuk, Daniel, Obadiah, Jonah, Zephaniah, all right, Matthew, Luke, John, okay, let's get, let's get some more, I already, I already said Paul, Right? Then you, you have different uh you have different uh brothers. Timothy, alright, Titus, and there there are different men that are spoken about in the scriptures, right, that don't have a a, a quote unquote uh um book in here written by them. Yet they did the works of Yahweh Shemia and they're remembered, man. And they're remembered through us. We'll, hey, we'll Lord's will we'll never forget what they did for us, man. Being out here on the highways and byways, okay, suffering, and they did that for us. And then we have to think about what our Lord did, man. Our Lord died for us, man. He was crucified, man. He was beaten. He was he was he was mocked by by everyone outside of the men that served him, man. You know, even in in even his family knew his purpose. But at the beginning of his ministry, his family was looking at him sideways. You know, he's 12 years old teaching in the temples. Right, what's, what, you know, what, what's, what's going on here? Even though they knew, they knew his purpose. The purpose that he served being here, man. Yet, it's obviously, if it's his family, man. So his family sees him, you know, as, as not as, as just a regular person. Because they knew that he's the son of the Most High. A, a, a certain spirit is on them. That's why, you know, different people in your life, if they know what you do, that they, they, they may know, okay, you know, he, he serves the most high, you know, he's on the highways and byways. But at the end of the day, if they're not in the truth, they, they just going to see you as a guy who, who, who does these things, yet you're just a regular guy. That's why we have to, hey, man, we, we have to consider ourselves in a special position. We in a specialized position, man. Hey, this is a, this is the spiritual special forces, man. All right, we not no average commoner, and the people understand that. When we don't have when we don't have this garment on. They see the way that we uh, um, talk the, uh, in our actions. They see how we eat, and they can tell. They can see that there's something special about us, man. We can see it. There's something special about you sincere brothers out there, man. When I watch y'all's videos, I'm, I'm, I'm edified, I'm inspired, you know? And I feel a certain way about it. I feel I feel like, you know, like it's a drink of water, man. You know, let's go. When I, when I, when I watch you brothers' videos, man, 
You know, it, it takes everything in me. When I'm at work, it takes everything in me not to scream out. That's right. You know, it takes everything for me, you know, not to call out to the Heavenly Father. You know how many times, you know, you'll, you'll be, you know, at work. You know, you listen to a video. You just want to scream out, Barak, the Abba, Shemel, Shah. Look at what he's done for us, man. He, hey, he took his only begotten son. The first spirit ever created. All right? Put him in the flesh. Okay? And had him be born through the act of sex, through, through Joseph and Mary, man. And had him suffer all sorts of things just for us to get this truth. Had our Lord not have come on the scene, we, we, we never would have known anything, man. That's why it took the action, it took the actual son of God to come down here to teach uh, the apostles, man. And to, and to teach other men also, but mainly the apostles. And what did the apostles do? They, they went out and they taught, all right? Go, go to the lost sheep of the house of Israel. That's what our Lord told the apostles. You know? Don't you know forget the world. Don't don't go to the world. Go to the lost sheep of the house of Israel. That's the only that's the only reason why we do these videos for the for the lost sheep of the house of Israel, man. Only the elect. Nobody else. Nobody else, nobody else is is allowed uh, uh, inside, man. Inside this strong tower. And the name of Yahweh Hashem Yahashai is a strong tower, man. And we need this. We need Yahweh Hashem Yahashai. Okay? And it says, Revelation chapter 19 and verse, it says, verse 5, And a voice came out of the throne saying praise our power all ye his servants and ye that fear him both small and great so you have you know the, the uh smaller you know smaller guys they got like i you know i'm a low i'm a low level i'm a low level brother but through the spirit we on a high level yet there's an order to this thing we can't you know we can't turn around and say yeah yeah i'm 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 better than habakkuk because we because we know more than Habakkuk. That doesn't make us better than Habakkuk. The spirit on the spirit on, on Habakkuk is you know. Now brothers, now brothers have a very strong spirit. I'm not saying that we don't have a strong spirit. What I'm saying is for, for brothers, you know, for if brothers can can really think about it, think about Habakkuk. Think about Amos, think about Esdras, man. They had a very important job. They, and, and not only that, they had to write down things, man. So a certain spirit had to be poured upon them to write things down. Okay? We're in the, we are in the spirit to prophesy the things that have been written down. That's our job. Our job is not, our job is not to write, man. Our job is to interpret the things that are written down. Okay? And the best way to do that, and the only way to do that, is to teach what was taught to us. Okay, and Lord, Lord's will, you know, uh, 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 through uh, the Lord working with you, understanding this truth. We, you know, we can do all the studying and all the, you know, all the, the, the research and everything. If the Lord ain't working with us, then it's for naught. That's why Lord's will, the Lord is working with us like he, you know, was working with these men. All right, and we are those men coming back. We are those men Lord's will that did not bow our knee to Baal. Part of that 7,000 men, you know, 7,000 going into completion, seven going into completion. Lord's will were those men that didn't bow, man. Lord's will, we stand firm. You brothers, man, continue to stand firm. You got, if you got a feeling like, man, you know, I'm not as, as on fire, man. You just pray, pray, pray to the most high, man. And sometimes you'll be praying and you, you kind of drift off, you, you start complaining. You start complaining to the Lord, you know? Well, you know, instead of praying for perseverance, you start complaining to the Lord, Lord, you know, this, you know, this and that, you know? <laughs> and that's Jake, man. Cause we, we were in a, a very sorrowful state, okay? And at the same time, we have to understand that the Lord, if we ask him for it, he's gonna, he's gonna do things for us, man. He's gonna give us a strong spirit. If you feel tired, if you go out to camp, 
pray to the Lord to, to, to uh, um, just just uh, refresh you, to renew you, man. There's a lot of brothers, you you know, a lot of us get off of work and then go to camp. You know, a lot of brothers, we on our feet 12 plus hours out of the day, you know. My specific job, I, I can't sit down. It is, it is what it is. And you constantly moving. Yet, that's what it is, man. All right, just pray the Lord. Okay, Lord, you know, make, you know, make, you know, please make this work for me. Make my body work. You know, have my, you know, have, get my spirit right, Lord. You know, the Lord's will. He does that for us, man. And there's no better feeling than being in the spirit. It's, it's sometimes you, you forget, you forget every damn thing. You know what I mean? You'll be so in the spirit. You'll have certain things that you, that you got to do. You completely forget about it. You know? Oh, I had, an, I had an appointment. I had an appointment at 10 a.m. Yet, yet the spirit comes over you at 9. At 9 a.m. to do a video. It's, a, it's, a, it's an hour and 25 minute video. You late to your appointment by 20 minutes. That's what the Lord wanted, man. That's it. You know? It's all about what the Lord wants. Okay? Uh, Revelation chapter 19 and verse... Six, and I heard as it were the voice of a great multitude, and as the voice of many waters, and as the voice of mighty thundering, saying, Halal Eloi Yahweh, for the Lord power omnipotent reigneth. Let us be glad and rejoice and give honor to him, Barakatha Yahweh by Shemel Shai. For the marriage of the Lamb is come, and his wife hath made herself ready. Yes, we're, Lord, we're we making ourselves ready, man, ready for the taking. Ready to be taken up. Ready to be seized, man. Okay? We're ready to be taken away. Okay? And swept up off our feet. And taken away to where, man? To, to the chambers. Shit, we trying to get up out of here. Okay? That should be that should be your mindset, man. Getting up out of this place and being what? Being swept, being swept away by the Heavenly Father's Son, man. Us being taken away from all this. And, and, a, lot of, and a lot of women think that way. I just want to uh, uh, be uh, uh, swept up, you know, from up off my feet and, and, and taken away. That's that's what we hoping, but we not hoping to go on vacation in Fiji, you know. Hey, we're, we're hoping for this place to be destroyed, okay, for us to be that beautiful bride, okay, being, anoint being anointed with oil, what you know, washed, being made beautiful. Okay, and then to be alongside our husband, man, which is Yahweh Shah Mashiach. And there, there it goes. It's demons, man. Once again, just like I said, every time, it's every time you come out here, it's demons, and that's a that's a that's a demon that hopped on them to do that, man. Okay, and Jake, when, when Jake is out here, when you hear that, you got hey, you got to be spiritually ready for war, man. This is a this is a battlefield out here, whether you know it or not. Cause it, you know, you can get a little shook up. It'll take you by surprise. You know, people will honk, it'll be loud. Or people will scream out. And how that sounded, I mean, if, if you were to be riding around in a neighborhood and you heard that, you'd be extremely alarmed. You'd be like, what, what the fuck? Somebody's hurt. Somebody, you know what I mean? That's and that's how Jake thinks. Okay, that something's wrong with him. No, man. They just got demons on him. That's it. We're gonna keep it pushing, man. Alright, Revelation 19. And they and they're gonna be it's like but they're gonna be screaming just like that coming soon. You women are gonna be screaming like you uh, uh in labor. So are you men. Okay. Basically, everybody who is not protected from your high shot. Okay, so it says, verse 8. And to her was granted that she should be arrayed in fine linen, clean and white. For the, for the fine linen is the righteousness of the saints. So that's that's our garment. The righteousness, man. We have to be we have to be found righteous. We have to be we have to be clean. You're not gonna get into some clean clothes and, and, and you you haven't taken a shower in three days, four days. No, I mean you you have to be washed with water. With with with, with you know uh with the soaps, with the oils, man. Then you're putting that and there's nothing. I wear a white a white t-shirt 
uh, almost every day. There, let me tell you something. There is nothing better, nothing better than you putting on a fresh white t-shirt with not a stain on it. And even if you get a small stain, the smallest stain, it could be just a dot from a pin. I mean, you you feel reluctant to wear it. You're like, man, this shit is this shit is stained, you know? It don't feel as good, man. And that's how we should feel in this too. We we should have an unstained garment. We hey, we should have the faith to understand, hey, we don't need to be adding leaven into this, man. Our own understanding. We need to teach what was taught to us, man. Don't go off and come up, come up with your own doctrine. And you got people that do that. You you got people that continue, they 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 come into this truth, they get a certain level of understanding, then all of a sudden they become the man. They become the big guy on campus. So now all of a sudden they, they start doing their own breakdowns and their own interpretations. Now all of a sudden they breaking off into a damn splinter group. Now all of a sudden the Lord don't matter. The name of the Lord don't matter. Now all of a sudden all nations can be saved. Now all of a sudden, you know what I mean, you this grand elaborate high priest, man. And the Lord and the that's the Lord destroying your mind, man. Thinking that you're something that you're not. We're just servants, man. At the end of the day, we serve. That's it. And Lord's will, we're rewarded for that. All right? So it says, verse 9, And he said unto me, Right, blessed are they which are called unto the marriage supper of the Lamb. So in order, in order to get, in order to, uh, get in this truth, stay in this truth, you got to be on the list. All right? That's that, that's that book of life. You know, that's that Lamb's Book of Life. You know, being, you know, and, and that's us being in that, that Lamb's Book of Life, being part of the elect, man. The Lord's will, you sincere brothers out there, man, you are of the elect. Okay? He says, And he said unto me, These are the true sayings of Yahweh Bahashem, Yahweh Shai. And I fell at his feet to worship him, and he said unto me, See thou do it not, I am thy fellow servant, and of thy brethren that have the testimony of Yahweh Shai. Worship Yahweh Shai, Shlakia. Worship Yahweh by Hashem Yahweh Shai, for the testimony of Yahweh Shai is the spirit of prophecy. The spirit of prophecy comes in the volume of this book. Alright? So we know what's going to happen. Through the spirit and power of Yahweh by Hashem Yahweh Shai. We know, we know that all hell is going to break loose. We know it's going to get to the point. We're not going to be out here on the highways and byways. Hundreds of cars passing by. Thousands of cars passing by. Nah, man. It's going to get to the point we're not even going to be able to be out here. Okay? And, but, you know, and if, and if you're able-bodied, man, come out. You know? And all, and all the brothers you know, different, you know, different ailments. You know, some brothers may have chronic, you know, chronic migraines or, you know, body aches. Different brothers, you know, got things going on. As long as I'm able to body, Lord's will, I can be out here on the highways and byways, man. That's it. Now, sometimes, you know, sometimes your body really hurts, you know. So you might have to do a little lean. You know, because I got a, um, I had a fractured ankle uh, some years ago, you know, before coming into the truth. So I have um, plates, uh, I got plates and, and screws and, and all kinds of shit uh, in my left ankle, you know, bad, you know, bad, you know, bad this, bad that, you know what I mean? You go through certain things, you go through certain traumatic uh, uh, traumatic injuries yet the Lord puts the spirit on you to keep going man you know and the elder brothers uh, the el and, and the elder apostles chiefly constantly go into that how um, all the different men of the Lord had different ailments some that weren't even mentioned you know like Paul had that um, had that pain in his side he probably had something you know something, something going on man Whatever, whatever he had going on, he had to continue to soldier on through it. And it's just like us. 
a lot of times when you deal with um, the pain and, and you you um, you 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 deal with pain management, after a while you you get accustomed to it. I, I'm I'm accustomed. Uh, to physically being in pain all the time. Yeah, and, and different brothers know exactly what I'm talking about. You wake up, you know, wake up, uh, 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 chest chest hurting, the ribs, the ribs hurting, neck hurting, side hurting. Certain brothers got a bad hip. Certain brothers got, you know, bad shoulders, bad neck, you know. And it, 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 it does not end. The, the number of ailments don't end. Yet, the spirit has you to keep pushing forward keep pushing forward man you know because it's, it's guys you know in, in, in Salakia not just guys but uh, it's brothers that subscribe to the, the teachings of Yahweh by Shemiah Shai that wish that they were able-bodied enough uh, to come out here on the highways and byways you know certain you know you, know, you got certain brothers who are uh, you know they they their ailments don't allow them to come out but you know if you can come out if the spirit is on you to come out come out you know once you come out stay out man you know and if you cut and if you come out you know you and you and you went uh and you, and you stop coming out come out man give yourself a chance through the spirit power of your how about shy man give yourself give yourself a chance man because you never know Brother, because you you got di you know different examples of different stories like Jeremiah. Jeremiah said, "I, Lord, I, I, I'm not doing this. I'm not doing this. I can't do this. I can't. I can't. I can't do this." What the Lord say? No, you you're you're gonna do it. You're going to do it. You know. So if the Lord if the Lord has put the spirit on you to go out and teach, that don't mean you can come you can come to camp. You know, one week and then don't then come back. No, that's not what I'm saying. What I'm saying is, if the spirit is on you to teach, man, and you get your second wind, you get that opportunity, don't make the mistake of, 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 of uh, 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 falling into complacency again, man. Okay? Because I've, ha I've had that happen, man. That happened to me. All right? I still, you know, you, 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 know, you go out in your, in your haste to um, serve the Heavenly Father, you know, and upon going out, you know, you're still messing up. You're still not all the way right. So what do you, you know, so what do you do? You still, you know, you're still watching the videos. You're still, you know, uh, trying to the best of your ability. And you're, you're, you're fucking up on, di on different things. You're still fucking up. So you feel like, man, I, I'm not worthy. I'm not worthy. You know, and, and, and you pray you fast. You get more right. You get more right. And you get that, and you get that opportunity. You know what I mean? It was a certain amount of months where I was just back into my steady mode, man, and not doing right. You know what I mean? Feeling con feeling condemned, like man, I you know, I'm not I'm not there yet. I'm, I'm I'm still messing up. You know what I mean? Still jacking up. Still 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 you know jacking things up. Still going off. You know? I heard from the elder uh, Yashawamba, hey, you you know you brothers. You know that is still that is still in, in this truth, man. If you're still in this truth, you still constantly been watching the videos, you writing down your notes, you're doing your different things. You know, you had a little hiccup, pop back out there. You know, and that really stuck with me, man. That very next week, I you know I was, I was praying, you know what I mean, fasting, and getting and getting right, man. You know, through the spirit power, you have about me on shot doing things truly to the best of my ability because a lot of times you think you're doing things with a you know with a certain amount of ability but you're not doing it to the best of your ability we still feel like that sometimes like man we're not even worthy yet if you're doing what you need to do through the spirit and power of your high body shot you are worthy man don't get don't get condemned in the mind just because you make mistakes but don't be just be willing uh uh, uh willful sinning you know if you have certain things that happen, don't don't let that dictate uh, uh, you being saved, man. You know, because ultimately it's up to the Heavenly Father. Yahweh Shai, if you're saved or not. But, you know, for, for you brothers, man, for you brothers out there that feel condemned in their mind, don't, don't feel condemned, man. You know? Fast, pray. You know, go over the go over the scriptures, man. And you have a chance. You know, and it's a beauty, it's a beauty that comes from that, man. 
You know, and the spirit had me to, to, to see that video. You know, because I, I was still in it. You know, it's just you, you come you come in, you first hear this truth, and you you're so ready. You're so ready to hit the highways and byways, and you ain't matured all the way yet. You know? Hey, so Barack the thing how about Shimia Shad for that? Barack the thing how about Shimia Shad. You know? And right as I right as I say that, this damn rib back here start acting up. And, it, and, and every day, every day in different moments, it's a different damn rib, man. Ribs just all, all fucked up. Neck all fucked up. Everything is jacked up. Yeah, our spirit is strong, man. You brothers have to understand that the spirit, the spirit the, the, your body's going to want one thing. The flesh is going to want one thing. Yet the spirit, the spirit is looking with, with, uh, 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 with, this, with, with itself single towards your how about Shimei Shai. That, hey man, we can do all things through your how about Shimei Shai, man. So don't, don't, you know, you brothers don't give up, man. Don't feel condemned in the mind. You know, keep keep going into your scriptures. Keep doing the things that you need to do, man. And how about Shimei Shai? Uh, he sees that, man. Right? He's omnipotent. He's omnipresent. Okay, and he a hey, and his eyes are ten thousand times brighter than the sun, roughly paraphrasing. And he has his angels, man. You know, so you brothers, man, don't feel don't feel condemned because of mistakes. All right. So if, it, if 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 we're through based off of mistakes, we're all through. Shit. You know. But continue to push forward. Continue, continue to the spirit and power behind about Shimei Shai to push forward. You know, because your body, your body, you know that your body is 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 a um is is a is a cage. It's chains of darkness. You know. <clears throat> Back to the scriptures, Revelation chapter nineteen and verse. 11. And I saw heaven open, and behold, a white horse, and he that sat upon him was called faithful and true, and in righteousness he doth judge and make war. Yahweh Shai. That's Yahweh Shai. His eyes were as a flame of fire, and on his head were many crowns, and he had a name written that no man knew but he himself. Alright, so he is he is king of kings, lord of lords, man. He's going to make all these uh, other nations, all these other kingdoms, subject unto him all right and, and how is that through uh, uh through his father the heavenly father it says and he was clothed with a vesture dipped in blood and his name is called the word of yahweh bahashem yahweh shai so once again the lord comes in the volume of the book the lord the lord, the lord actually came here upon the earth Right? Uh, uh, he's now on the right hand side of the Heavenly Father. Okay? He's also the volume of this book. Okay? The spirit of Yahweh Shah Hamashah is in this book. The spirit of Yahweh Shemiah Shah is in this book. Okay? Okay? And, 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 hey, the Holy Spirit. Alright? The Holy Spirit. You you cannot forget the Holy Spirit. See, you guys, they just say, oh, Yahweh, you, you, you forget Yahweh Shah, you forget. The Rakakwadash, you forget the Holy Spirit, man. Okay? You can't, you can't just have the Heavenly Father. You gotta have His Son. Okay? You gotta have the Holy Spirit. Okay? And, that, and that's not that's not blaspheming the name of the Heavenly Father if we're saying we can't just find salvation through only Yahweh. That's not that's not blasphemy. Okay? Because we're saying you, you have to worship his son. Okay? And you have to fall in line with the Holy Spirit. We ain't just out here saying, you know, call halal Yahweh. That's it. No, man. Yahweh by Hashem, Yahweh Shai, by Hashem, Rakakwadash, man. That's the name and the title of who the world ignorantly calls God and Jesus Christ and the Holy Ghost. All right? So it says. Verse 14, and the armies which were in heaven followed him upon white horses, clothed in fine linen, white and clean. And out of his mouth goeth a sharp sword, that with it he should smite the nations, and he shall rule them with a rod of iron. And he treadeth the winepress 
of the fierceness and the wrath of the almighty power. And he hath on his vesture and on his thigh a name written, King of Kings and Lord of Lords. Then that's in all caps. That's in all caps, man. That's a, that's a, there's a significance to that. Okay? You only see these words uh, uh, in this Bible in all caps, you know, like a handful of times, man. Okay? And it says... And I saw an angel standing in the sun, and he cried with a loud voice, saying to all the fowls that fly in the midst of heaven, Come and gather yourselves together unto the supper of the great hour, that ye may eat the flesh of kings and the flesh of captains, the flesh of mighty men, the flesh of voices, and of them that sit on them, and the flesh of all men, both free and bond, both small and great. So the, the, the Lord has promised these birds a great feast. It's gonna be it's gonna be vultures out here. Crows and shit picking, picking out eyeballs. Alright? And I saw the beast and the kings of the earth and their armies gathered together to make war against him that sat on the horse and against his army. Alright? So you you damn you damn devils, you gonna try to go against our Lord, man. You're gonna fail miserably. Alright, it says, and the beast was taken, and with him the false prophet that wrought miracles before him. With which he slucked it, with which he deceived them that had received the mark of the beast, and them that worship his image. These both were cast alive into a lake of fire burning with brimstone. That's that's his place. That's that's the lake of fire, man. Alright, speaking about America, America is that lake of fire. And how's that lake of fire gonna come about? It's gonna come about through the missiles. Alright? And the remnant were slain with the sword of him that sat upon the horse, which sword proceeded out of his mouth. All the fowls were filled with their flesh. Woo! And I saw an angel come down from heaven, having the key of the bottomless pit, and a great chain in his hand. And he laid hold on the dragon, that old serpent, which is the devil, and Satan, and bound him a thousand years and cast him into the bottomless pit and shut him up and set a seal upon him that he should deceive the nations no more till the thousand years should be fulfilled. After that, he must be loose a little season. And so this, this nigga done already got locked up and got out for a little bit, okay? During the times of the um, Dark Ages, right? In which, in which his ass was in uh, 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 subjection and slavery. All right, he came out, he came on the scene he reimagined himself, this damn devil. He created different artwork, different music, which that was which that was Jake painting those paintings, by the way. You damn devils aren't able to paint like that. All right, and the music, okay, you use Jake for that. You've been using Jake, okay? So you do all these different, you do all these different things, and now look at you, okay? It says, Receive the nation no more till the thousand years should be fulfilled, and after that, he must be loose a little season. So we in that little season, right? What you, 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 you devils are through. You devils are done for. Okay. And I saw thrones, and they sat upon them, and judgment was given unto them. And I saw the souls of them that were beheaded for the witness of Yahweh Shai, and for the word of Yahweh, which had not worshipped the beast, neither his image. Neither had received his mark upon their foreheads or in their hands. And they lived and reigned with Hamashiach a thousand years. But the rest of the dead lived not again until the thousand years were finished. This is the first resurrection. Woo! Hey, man. It's going to be a great time. We're going to be, hey, we're going to be having a lot of fun. Hey, there's going to be certain Israelites that are going to be born a little bit later. You know? Gonna be born a little bit later. That's gonna be that's gonna be part of, of being the two thirds, man. You're gonna have to come through the loins of the elect. So it's gonna have to wait a little bit, you know. Now you now as soon as you're born, you coming into in, in, into paradise, so to speak. You coming into perfection. It's gonna be a certain amount of time, man. You know. So we want to be the first crop of Jake to 
come into the kingdom. We want to be first in line. Like when you have a grand opening for a restaurant, you have a grand opening for a, uh, you know, a, a, a museum or some sort of attraction, you're the first to see the art. You're the first to ride the rides. You're the first to step in. You're the first to order off the menu. You know what I mean? That's what we want to be. We want to be first in line, man. What does the scripture say? The last shall be the first, and the first shall be the last, man. So all you, all the heathens, you're not going to be in line, man. You out of here. And as far as Jake, all right, and you know, the Jake that was last, that, that was looked down upon, you're going to be the first. And all you, you quote unquote, uh, uh, celebrity Jakes, athlete Jakes, lest you repent and turn to Yahweh by Shemesh, you're going to be, you're going to be last, man. You're going to be coming, you're going to be coming in last. You're going to be generated through the loins of the elect, which, hey, man, hey, as long as, hey, as long as you're an Israelite, Barak at the Yahweh Shai. That's something you should be looking forward to. No, but no, nobody wants to be, like, you know, late, late to the party, so to speak. You know, you want to be, you want to be the first one there, man. You know, like, like Jake, like Jake in the club. Jake, when Jake go to the club, Jake be the first one in the club, man. While the lights are still on. Before they even cut the lights off and turn the music on, Jake up in there, man. You know, so you want to be, you want to be first in the kingdom of heaven, man. You want to be found as the righteous. Hey, the people, right, and specifically the men that did the good, uh, uh, that did the will of Yahweh Hashem Yahweh Okay? And are taken in that chariot, okay, made perfect, and then brought down, you know. Hey, that's, that's the kingdom of heaven. The kingdom, the kingdom of heaven, hey, man, is being established before your very eyes, man. And that final ribbon cutting is going to be uh, after the Lord makes us perfect and we're, and we're sent down upon the earth man. we're going to be doing the cleanup process everything going to be you know we're going to be hey man we're going to have you heathens and chains man it's going to be great it's going to be a great time all right Woo! we can't wait man <laughs> that's just a figure of speech we can we can wait you know we can wait as long as the lord needs us to we, hey man it's like you're excited. When you're excited, you can't sleep. You know? So we can't fall asleep now, man. You know? You brothers that are kind of dozing a little bit. You know? Wake up. Get more on fire. Get more invigorated, man. The Lord's will. The, 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 the Lord put the spirit on me uh, uh, to go through more of these different videos and these different things that I'm uh, seeing. You know? go into some screen recording lessons based on these different articles uh, that I'm seeing in these different videos, man. His brother's got to produce, you know, now more than ever. We can't get in the spirit of, okay, you know, you know we're, 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 we're just studying right now, you know what I mean? Still, you know, come out with your videos, you know what I mean? And, and you know, and, and brothers fall victim to that. Okay, I, I got to, you know, I'm going to do this video on this day. You know, then you don't do it. You know what I mean? Now you can't force the spirit, but at the same time, you have to you have to pray for the Lord to put that spirit on you to do certain things, man. You know, and that's that's something that you know brothers learn. You know, I, I'm 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 learning that every single day. You know, you have to ask the Lord for what you want, and you have to show Him that you want it. You know, much like a father. You, if you want if you want the, if you want that um uh um you know Rubik's cube. You gonna mow that lawn? You gonna take out that trash? You know, <laughs> hey Ruby's cube. You know, Jake wants some more elaborate shit. You know, when I was a kid, you know, you want a Ruby's cube or a bike. You know, you just. But at the same time, what do your parents say? Well, this is what you're supposed to be doing. So we supposed to be doing this. You know, we just supposed to be real fervent about it. And have a, and have a certain uh, uh, spirit about it. To do what the Lord asks us to do, uh, uh, and. and not expect a reward yet pray to the heavenly father that we get a reward which is uh, uh more understanding you know more responsibility more you know what i mean and, and, and for the lord to show more of his love to us man we need the lord's love we don't need the love of these people man we need the we need the love of the how about shine man so that says revelation 
chapter 20 in verse 6 blessed and holy is he that hath part in the first resurrection on such the second death hath no power so that second death is going into the missiles man it's going into the missiles so whoever is there in the first resurrection is that that uh that number of Israelites that didn't get hit by the missiles, man. Okay? It's beautiful. Eddie, 144,000 and one-thirds. That's the elect, man. That's what we want to be. Okay? It says, But they shall be priests of Yahweh and of Hamashiach, and shall reign with him a thousand years. And that's not and that's not just us reigning with the Lord for a thousand years. We're going to reign, we're going to reign forever. You know, there has to be that certain amount of time that the kingdom of he heaven is, is, is being uh, uh, established basically off the backs of Eve. See, after that, a thousand years, after that, a thousand years, uh, Eve's going to be done away with. Okay? So in that period, in that period of time, things are going to be getting built up, built up, built up, built up by E and the, and the other nations. And then basically the other nations after E is, is done away with. And they're going to be glad to, 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 do, to do the upkeep. They're going to be glad. He is going to be glad to, to prepare uh, uh, things and, and, and move things and do all these things, man. They're going to be proud. Hey, man. Hey, man. They, they're, they're going to love to punish E. We're going we to tell a hand, hand might beat this damn devil's ass. He's going he, he to say, Khan, he's going to do it. You know what I mean? Gladly, with a smile on his damn face, man. Okay, um, Revelation 20 and 7. When a thousand years are expired, Satan shall be loosed out of his prison. Okay, so go, uh, uh, so going, so going back and shall go out to deceive the nations which are in the four quarters of the earth. Yeah, so, uh, when it's speaking about this, and see, people get these time frames mixed up, they see the see the, the Bible jumps all over the place. You, you gotta hold on for the ride, you know what I mean. Right, it says, um, going, uh, going back, let me read that again. Revelation 20 and 8. It shall go out to deceive the nations which are in the four quarters of the earth, Gog and Magog, to gather them together to battle, which that's um, the so called Russians. That's so called land of Russia. The number of whom is as the sand of the sea. And they went up on the breadth of the earth and compassed the camp of the saints round about and the beloved city. Speaking about uh, America, it says, The fire came down from Yahweh out of heaven and devoured them. And the devil that deceived them was cast into the lake of fire and brimstone, where the beast and the false prophet are. Woo! It shall be tormented day and night forever and ever. So basically, this place is going to be uh, uh, on fire for a certain amount of time, you know? So that's not talking about, that's not talking about hell. It's talking about this place being bombarded. Okay. Verse eleven. I'm gonna end uh, the video. I'm gonna end the video on this uh, on this precept. And I saw a great white throne, and him that sat on it, from whose face the earth and the heaven fled away, and there was found no place for them. Woo! So you 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 damn he you damn heathens. There, there's no place for you. There is no salvation. There is no. You getting saved? There is no, um, there is no. Oh, you you get your, you know your your second chance. You you didn't get a first chance. All right, there is no chances. You never had a chance. There was never salvation for you at all. For any of you nations outside the nation of Israel, man, there was never any chance for you. You were always done. You were always through from the beginning. Okay, you can't miss something that you never had, man. Okay? You never had the blessings. You never had the promise. Okay? Of Yahweh Shai coming and saving you. Okay? And being sent by Yahweh. You never had that chance, man. So just so so just get over it. Yet they're gonna they're gonna come after us, they're gonna persecute us, and really they're persecuting uh Yahweh by Hashim Yahweh Shai. Really they're persecuting Yahweh Shai Hamashah. So we have to stand firm. So you brothers to team to stand firm, man. All right. So with that, Lord's will, you are, you are edified, man. Lord's will, you are edified. You know.
brought caught Akim to you brothers, man. You brothers keep on pushing, man. You brothers who are just coming into this crew, keep watching the great Millstone videos, man. You know? Watch them brothers out there, the, the, the Men of Valor brothers, man. You know? And subscribe to that brother, uh, Bakar Amath. Uh, uh, he's a brother out there in New York. And I believe he's, I believe he's in the uh, Men of Valor uh, camp, I believe. You know, because you have different men, you know, that although they're not up under the banner of Great Millstone, they, they, uh, uh, they subscribe to the teachings of Yahweh Ba'ashim Yahashai through the Elder Apostles of Great Millstone. So even if they're not in Great Millstone, they're a part of Great Millstone. Because who's, who is the ultimate Great Millstone? Yahweh Shai. Yahweh Shai is going to be that, that, um, <laughs> it's gonna be that giant millstone that's gonna come and just crush every damn thing. He's gonna he's gonna be the, the ultimate party pooper. When Yao Shai comes on the scene, everything is going to stop, man. And he's coming as a representative of his father, Yahweh, man. Okay? So with that, brought call Akim to you, brothers. I'm go ahead and I'm gonna turn the east and give all the praise on the glory. Unto Yahweh, Bahashim, Yahweh Shai. Bahashim, Rakak, Wadash. Double honors to the elder apostles of Great Millstone, who rule well and teach well and taught me this truth. And a sincere shalom to you, Akim, out there, to you brothers out there who are pushing this word in sincerity and in faith. May Yahweh Bahashim, Yahashai, Bahashim, Rakak, Wadash, bless you and your household, man. Okay? Above, above! Alright? Kwam, Masha'Allah. It's an it's a, it's a, it's a empty, it's a empty feeling out here, man. This place is through and this place is dead, man. Kwam Yasha Allah and Barak call Akim to you brothers once again, man. Call Halal Yahweh Yahawah Ba'ashim Yahashai Ba'ashim Ha Rekak Wadash Barakatham to you brothers out there, man. All right, this is your brother, Giyar Aira. Okay, Lord's, Lord's will, the spirit, all right, can continue to move on me. Uh, and Thawada to the Rekak Wadash, the Holy Spirit, uh, you know, for, for being with me as I perceive uh, to, to push the words out of Yahweh Ba'ashim Yahashai. Lord's will, you know what I mean? I can continue to put some videos up, man. Do the spirit and power of Yahweh by Shimia and Shai. You brothers, man, you brothers, don't get in a certain spirit. Hey, it's, it's something that's about to take place, man. We can feel that through the spirit. Just stay strong, brothers. We almost up out of here. Shalom. Hey, and DTA. All right.